Hi friends, welcome back to my channel, SciTicker. In this video, I'm going to do the CPU routing test in the iQOO 9 smartphone on the day one of usage. Yes, when this meant day one of using the iQOO 9 device, and the phone has got the Snapdragon 888 Plus chipset. And let's see what's going to be the CPU routing results in the iQOO 9 device. And this is my first time doing the CPU routing test in the iQOO 9 smartphone as well. If I do a uh, so it's the CPU throttling application friends which I'm trying to use for the first time and let's use the 100 threads and let's use for the 15 minutes of time. Same time 15 minutes as you can see I'm trying to use exactly 100 threads and 15 minutes and 50% brightness I'll try to keep and right now the temperature is about 31 degrees Celsius and maroon temperature is also pretty same. 31 degrees and 31 degrees exactly same okay my room temperature and the phone temperature and there is no AC there is no cooler in my room exactly right now nothing at all. So let's find out what's happening with the temperature readings and what's going on with the throttling and everything and without using any monster mode I'm trying to do on the day one of usage. And we'll try to find out exactly friends how much high temperatures the phone can increase and how much low the performance can decrease because of high temperatures. We'll try to do this kind of testing in this device and I will be back after some time. So right now as you can see friends the throttling has started to happen in this device after 5 minutes of time exactly. So exactly after 5 minutes and now let's check the temperatures what's happening 40 degrees the temperature did increase on the back set 30 and 40.4 degrees celsius on the back and front you can clearly see friends so 40 degrees temperature the phone did increase in the iq 9 device exactly with the snapdragon 888 processor and right now the time is about 6 minutes of time and i can be back after some time so then we'll try to discuss and right now the throttling did decrease up to 80 percentage or 79 percentage that is what I'm expecting regarding the throttling percentage levels. And I will be back after some time. So final friends, we are reaching close to the end of the test results. You can clearly see here. So 14 minutes of time and let's check the temperatures what's happening here. Temperatures did maintain around 40 degrees Celsius. So it's kind of continuously constant maintaining. It did not increase above 40 degrees. That's kind of one good sign I would say. Definitely it's maintaining exactly 40 degrees Celsius. But overall regarding the throttling, it did throttle up to I think 79 and 80 percent is somewhere around that. I was expecting 78, 79. Let's find out and 79. You can clearly see in 79 percentage the throttling did happen clearly. That's also like it's kind of average I would say. It's not too great and not too bad. It's average. In anything close to 80 percentage that's kind of average. So close to 90 percentage that's good. Above 90 percentage that's very good. That's how the clear. Uh, classification will be there in terms of the CPU throttling but this is the day one of using without any monster mode in this device in the iQOO 9 smartphone that's it friends thank you for watching this is a quick look and in case if you have other questions let me know in the comment section below and meanwhile signing off until then stay tuned for more updates and make sure to follow the playlist for more videos until then bye